Hi everybody, this is Boaz Fahler and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for February 10th, 2016. So, the Moon is still in Pisces today and it's very much affected by Neptune, still moving away from that conjunction that we had yesterday. It's a very spiritual, intuitive, a time full of fantasy. We could have amazing talks today. It's not such a good energy to take that locomotive of daily life forward. So just enjoy it. But as the day progresses, we're going to go into a conjunction with Chiron, which is already a lot more sensitive. And it talks about being in touch with the places that we are hurting or people around us are hurting or basically being in touch with our feelings and not necessarily our um, stronger, more positive feelings, but the places we feel hurt and down. But even though we're moving into that conjunction, there's a few aspects today that are going to work with that conjunction that are really talking about the essence of this day. The first one is a square to Saturn. It's going to be happening at around 1000 hours Central European time. It's going to be way in your bedtime American, so I'm not going to even say what hour it's going to be. And this is a time that we could feel a little insecure. Our mood could be a little down, so we need to watch that. And then there's a sextile to Pluto, which really gives us the power to mold our own life and to find our inner power to do that. It's about taking that scalpel and that hammer and molding that rock, that rock of our life. Even though the stone, the stone is hard. It's hard work. And even though we have to take the tools that's been given to us and start molding our life from the power we have within us. So that's the sextile to Pluto. Right afterwards, we're starting with a trine to Mars that's going to be in its highlight at around 1900 hours Central European time. That's about 1200 hours Eastern Standard Time. And the conjunction to Chiron is going to be exact at that time too. What does it mean? It means we're going to be in touch with our more sensitive side. It's going to be all around. It's going to be like either with people in our lives dealing with something that we have to take care of them or with our, our own selves that we feel like we're burdened or that we want to have more fun but we get all work, work, work. And the trying to, to, to Mars really says, come on, find that energy, rise up to the challenge. You can do this and through doing it, even though it's not easy, you will find how, to, how strong you really are. So we need to pass this day with a lot of humility, with a lot of giving thanks, and really, as I said, find our own inner power and rise up to the challenge. Other than that, the sun is queen coxing Jupiter in the, sun, in the sky, reminding us to focus and do less and be modest with our actions and with our goals and really not put things up there, but ground them on a well-founded reality. So, thank you for listening, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.